Lead star Coke left with bloodied face and forced to change splattered shorts after clash with Man United's McTominay. Robin Coke was left in a bloody mess after nastily clashing heads with Scott McTominay in Leeds' clash with Manchester United. In the 13th minute of the game, the 25-year-old German defender played a pass before being met head-on by the Scottish midfielder. He went down and it was immediately clear that a nasty gash had formed above his eyebrow. The Leeds medics raced on to treat him, and Coke was initially able to carry on after having his head bandaged up. But not before he changed both his shirt and shorts, as blood had dripped onto them. The Leeds staff were forced to block the camera's view of Coke while he stripped down and changed his shorts on the sidelines. Then on the half-hour mark Coke went down again, and this time he was forced off as he felt the after-effects of the collision. Meanwhile, McTominay walked away from the incident unscathed despite it looking incredibly painful. The clash of heads stunted Leeds' momentum after they had made a superb start to the game. The host stung the fingertips of David De Gea on a couple of occasions in front of a raucous Ellen Road crowd. Leeds were hosting Man United in front of a crowd in the Premier League for the first time in more than 18 years. Last season the two sides played out a goalless draw behind closed doors due to the coronavirus pandemic. The last time they met with supporters at Elland Road was way back in October 2003, when Roy Keane scored the winner in a 1-0 victory for Man United, one half read our football news live blog.